In this module, you will learn about scaffolding the sixth grade social studies cornerstone task for advanced learners. The essential question for this module is how can scaffolding the cornerstone task to suit the needs of diverse learners allow for student transfer of knowledge? The Cornerstone Task Teacher's Guide found in Module 2B provides additional steps for students that may need more scaffolding to successfully demonstrate mastery of transfer. You can refer to the video module entitled Scaffolding for Struggling Learners for more information. However, we may also need to scaffold to provide enrichment for our more advanced learners as they attempt to complete the task. For advanced students, there are several possible avenues to differentiate instruction. One option is to provide students with checkpoints to make sure they are on task, but limit teacher assistance as necessary. Consider making the task more challenging by removing previously discussed supports like graphic organizers. Some advanced learners may even be capable of creating their own organizers or outlines during preparation time. You could also consider allowing students to choose a more challenging product, like a s'more.com blog, a Weebly site, or a Google site. Be open to ideas generated by students, as long as their product meets the specifications established by the Cornerstone Task Rubric. You can also provide students access to video tutorials for technology use and presentation development. For example, if a student wants to create a Weebly and they haven't used it before, you can direct them to YouTube or the Weebly website for video tutorials. Lastly, at the end of the Cornerstone task, you could have students participate in a gallery walk in which students travel around the classroom to view and or read the final products of their classmates. Be open to ideas generated by students for the final product. If they come up with an idea to do an infographic, website, or other creative final product, be sure to do what you can to encourage and assist students in making their idea work for their editorials or blogs. This video module provides some suggestions for how to scaffold a task for your advanced learners. However, that doesn't mean that you can't use additional strategies or resources that you create or find. Feel free to do what you need to in order to scaffold this task for your students. Remember that it is imperative that you don't alter the integrity and authenticity of the task. If you still have additional questions about scaffolding the cornerstone task for struggling learners, please contact your content specialist.